our way to our next destination, which is Hakone. Oh. <laughs> so we're currently just um, going to this area in Shinjuku Station where we actually get our Hakone Pass. Um, it's good for two days, yep. but we're only doing a day trip. So we'll take you guys with us and hopefully you enjoy our adventure today. Like you tell, we've got the train in front of us. Apparently this train actually goes up a little hill. So we'll see how it goes because everyone's just lining up here so we're just hoping for the best. Yeah. Hopefully we get there. Hopefully. We were kind of like, are we expecting like a hundred of cable cars coming in? But no, I love it. It's just like a train. Yeah, it's but like, a single track up and down. Yeah, but it's surprisingly like, it fits a lot of people because at first we we're just like, we might have to wait for a second time. But yeah. we're finally here, but the views are honestly so, so nice. uh, amazing. <laughs> Look at that. How unreal is that? It, yeah, it is really windy and the sulfur smell smells like a rotten egg. So, but it's just so cool. It is so cool. And I, I just love the fact that we actually get to see Mount Fuji from here because it's it's a very clear day. We're in line for the number one thing you have to do when you get up here. <laughs> and that is trying the black egg. The shell of the egg turns black because of the sulfur and apparently it's supposed to add seven years on top of your life. Which so. is good because when you're married you lose about 12. <laughs> oh come on, you lose about 20. <laughs> so you probably get the black eggs. You're 500 yen and you get 5 pieces. Almost looks like a raw. Yeah. Does it smell weird? It's hot. Mm -hmm. Hey? Yeah, it's definitely warm to the touch. Yeah. It does smell like a sulfur. But they give you some salt as well. So we're going to give it a try. It just looks like a normal egg inside. It does just smell like a normal egg. I didn't expect it to be warm. So that's how it looks, guys. As you can see, it kind of gets your hand messy from the sulfur. Yeah. Cheers. Okay. Cheers to my regular egg. That's pretty neat, though. Definitely a lot more for experience factor than taste factor. Exactly. I, I feel like I already got seven years since I've been <laughs> So you guys enjoyed the, the views of Mount Fuji, because yeah. we definitely are. We're, told, we're actually looking at right now while we're eating the black eggs. So, really cool experience. If you've ever come to Japan, you need to come to Hakone. Yeah, try to find a good day, a good clear day. Uh, we got lucky today for sure. If we would have went tomorrow, there's no way we would have saw No. And I love the fact that you can kind of see some snow in Mount Fuji. And like there's a little bit of clouds, but like it's not covering it at all. So right behind us is this famous little egg here. And it's color black. So you really know that you're in a Kone with a beautiful view of Mount Fuji when you see this egg. <laughs> Look 
What do you think about this view? It's honestly unreal. Like, one side you got the lake, the other side Mount Fuji. And the fact that you can see it is a miracle. People have been coming here and have never seen it. It's been covered in the clouds, so we got so, so lucky today to see it. Just got outside the car now, heading down the mountain, but the trip's not done yet. And I hope you guys enjoyed that little view of our way down to... No, oh, I know I did. Little ferry. Where are we going, babe? We're going to this little ferry thing that looks very medieval. We're in Hakone, and I love how you get to have different views. One in the water and one up there, and this is definitely one of the experiences you need to do here. Arby, we're we'll be heading on the ship there. <laughs> so I got this chocolate bread, and it's actually just 200 yen. I'm gonna give it a try. It's really soft. It's like pillows. Mmm. Mmm. -mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> give, me, give me 200 yen then. You know kind of tastes like? What? That bread that we get for Christmas. It's like powder on top of it. It's powder sugar. Mm -hmm. Look at it. So, me and Brennan is spirit of being snacky. We got this thing called jagabi, which is like a Japanese like potato crackers, I guess. So we're going to give it a try. It was 320 yen. Wow. So this box actually came with... Smells Fries, actually. Ladies and gentlemen, we will serve you. Just a fries. Yeah. Like fries crackers, like really, really crispy fries. Yeah. Yum. Jaga B, I'm gonna. I love you. <laughs> the last cable car which we probably will be missing but aside from all that Takoni has been probably one of our favorite experiences here in Japan we were kind of contemplating coming here today because it was a little bit on the pricier side yeah and uh, we just didn't want to waste too much time like we didn't feel like we saw enough in Japan, uh, Tokyo so we wanted to maybe dock and stay in Tokyo for today but we decided to go for it and I'm glad we did we got so lucky yeah so we were supposed to come tomorrow but instead we changed today because when we checked the weather it was supposed to be raining and thank god we did because we are probably one of the luckiest people that get to experience and see Mount Fuji yeah, without any... Yeah, it was crystal clear, not a single cloud block in it. It was honestly amazing. Yes. And at the same time, like, although the weather was a little bit on the colder side, it was definitely all worth it for the views, but we're finally going back and I'm just really happy we get to experience the cold. We made it! <laughs> Like, so far, I think so. Yeah, uh, first destination, first checkpoint anyway. We'll see if we can keep going. Yeah. But yeah. As long as we get to the train, I think we'll be okay. Yeah, we gotta run our ass off, but we're nice and here now. We have the car basically to ourselves yeah. almost. There's two other people. And then it's almost like the sun is a little bit setting, so it's definitely a really nice way to ride a phone. Oh, thank God. Hope you guys like the video today. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe. Any comments down below, we'll get back as fast as we can and keep watching. Bye guys.